hello everyone welcome again to my channel in today's video i will be showing you guys how i create a straight center part on my micro braided wigs and i will be using this part to show you guys how the lace net looks like so this is the center part right here and the braids usually fall either to the left and to the right and the middle part falls right there this is my zoomed version of the lace net and i'm going to use it to show you guys where the needle goes and the spaces between each braid so keep watching so these are the holes that form the center part right there and now i'm going to show you guys where i put the latch hook so my crochet needle goes right there and it goes through three or four holes if you want to and this is the line that i skip and the next braid goes in the next hole and goes through one two and three again and you repeat the process so pretty much this is what I do and I know it's very hard sometimes for me to zoom in on the lace net itself to show you guys during my tutorial so I hope this helps and you repeat the process on the other side so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how I do it on a wig that I made for a client so keep watching so I decided to highlight for a better understanding so these are the braids right here and then you have the spaces in between each braid and there you have the center part and then you have the braids on the other side you can check out my video on how to sew the lace net on the wig cap so you know the direction in which to place your lace net so let's go ahead and get this wig started Now I'm done with one side and I'm going to repeat the same process on the other side. It takes time, focus and patience to get a neat finish. You can also check the description for the full tutorial and other related videos. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the final look. So guys, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe to my channel if you like my content. Thank you guys so much for watching. Remain creative and I'll see you guys in my next video.